Good morning. Voila. Today as hounds, we stand before God, our families, and Notre Dame to pledge our loyalty. To God, we express our belief in the primacy of the spiritual. To our families, we express our gratitude for the foundation of our being. To Notre Dame, we commit to the ideals, to the search for excellence, to be true men and women of Notre Dame, as directed by Pear when he described the Notre Dame man and woman. The world today is looking for men and women who are not for sale, who are honest, sound from center to circumference, true to the heart's core, with conscience as steady as Neil to the pole, who will stand for the right, the heavens totter, and the earth reels, who can tell the truth and look the world right in the eye, who neither flag nor flinch, who have courage without shouting it, and in whom the courage of everlasting life runs still, deep, and strong, who know their message and tell it, who know their place and fill it, who know their business and attend to it, who will not lie, shrink, or dodge, who are not too lazy to work or too proud to be poor, who are willing to eat what they have earned and wear what they have paid for, who are not ashamed to say no with emphasis. God is looking for them. He wants those who can unite together around a common faith, join hands in a common task, who have come for the kingdom for such a time as this. God, give us such as them. Not only will they be better prepared to fulfill their duty as citizens, they should make better friends, better husbands, better fathers, better wives, better mothers, because free people do. And in short, they will be better prepared to live. And when their hour comes, they will know better how to die, because free people do. Today, we leave Notre Dame as alumni. We pledge to uphold our commitment to Othel Mary College of Notre Dame, to dream our dreams greatly, and to struggle and emerge. Thank you.